So our recipe today is a popular Gambian delicacy which is fried fish, beans and our palm oil stew um, sauce. We are going to eat the fried fish and fried fish. We are going to eat the fried fish and fried fish. We are going to eat the fried fish and fried fish. We are going to eat the fried fish and fried fish. We are going to eat the fried fish and fried fish. We are going to eat the fried fish and fried fish. So this is basically how we cook our beans, our sauce, stir fry sauce with the cassava and our fish. I've got my red snapper fish here guys. And I'll show you the traditional way of seasoning your fish. So that's the beans I'm going to be using. I've got my cassava here in the pot, pot ready to be um, boiled on the side. So I'll just kickstart this, put it on the side. Then I'll put my beans on the side and I'll work on the, work on the fish. Right, so I'm going to get a few more. 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 So, all we need is um, the natural flavor of the fish. So, I'm going to get a few more. So, we need is um, the natural flavor of the fish. So, tradition as usual. I'm going to get a few more. Ini yang nak dor, def sun limong, dawa le limong minono. Ia yang hamgen ni lulu min dengan kopi sibir barif em kitchen lah, barif em kitchen lah. Kopi dia membokal, mulu lotek jen nak te dawa le ulos salimau. Ngani? So that's it. Um, I've just stirred on this side. I'm gonna turn it to the other side. You all but ini. Kopi nak dawa le ko ya go nawa he dawa le mai dah. Dawa le top abim sis. Wah, buat pusat dia nabi simbarai bi hamgen ni manfi nak nama itu mirwi top akagi. Right, so you can see, I've just grabbed my pair of gloves. I have here my Maggi cubes, so stock seasoning, any choice, any stock seasoning of your choice, you can use it, and we're gonna be drizzling it. Wait a minute, before I start anything, just take out some time and appreciate the beauty of my outfit. Ah, Lina Mom, this is Jaggi Falcombe, so Sarah Design, Kombe, so outfit bang in it, Kombe, my Bahi, Lina, my body them. So I mix my stock seasoning here and this is my stock seasoning. Right guys, so you can see that's our hot pepper which is the pepper powder. It depends on you. I just love to um, blend my bird eye chili peppers. I'm with hot. Kani you say you know no. How many drink man do we buy? Kabi dama topa di jahase suma ay kani. Di jahase suma ay pobar. Di safal da di sasal. Wow, bugu madak darah lu he lu he tidur saya dah naferos sasal darlek, okay? You really, but I just want to stick to the natural recipe as much as possible. So voila, voila, voila. Sprinkle it on top, okay? You dah nak dekat defni, okay? Yang sunjuk ni rek, korang leh nak bimsaf. Magnificent. Giving it a good rub, then you turn it to the other side. So we'll be doing the same on the other side as well. I like nak limon original lenyawa. Limon haram jin berak am lenyaw ham lenak sal lenyaw emsa. I can now buy fair limon. We mana magui ke mana dah harga. Perfecto. So that's perfect. Right, right, right here. Thing done, I'll just remove my gloves and clean film it because I want the powder seasoning to be um, to season the fish well. So I do not want to. Um... Right, guys, so can you see we're actually cooking our beans and the cassava? Okay, so this again, you make a knock. You just do this, so 
ñebe ak ñambi bi ñambi bi mom rahasal bem set def sa ndox bu em dal di ko tek mom na baxal nga baxal ko nak bul ko baxal be nga xamne dafa noy be tass ndax dañ ko bugga rek mu bax be ñor rek way dañ ko tege bor so make sure you don't overcook the cassava we just want it cooked um just make sure it's well cooked but it doesn't have to be too mushy so this is our beans as well on the side leave it boiling here and oh la la right guys so we're moving on to our sauce this is the palm oil sauce i'll be making so meanwhile i'm just melting my palm oil i'll just come and blend the spring onions and these hot chili pepper you can use um scotch bonnet pepper these chili peppers are very hot so I'll be using them today in my sauce and the palm oil stir fry we use. You can use um, normal cooking oil if you do not have palm oil and you want to try it out because this is so nice. With the beans on the side and the fried fish, absolutely beautiful. Right, so I'm gonna be chopping, chopping the onions and then from there, we're, gonna be, we're going to be blending it. So. So I'll put everything in here. Right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a two handfuls of our onion. We diced. You can see I've just diced here five onions. So I'm just going to take two handfuls add it to what I'm blending can you see because this is to ensure I have sauce right okay this is not the only one that you can do 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 the only one that Right guys, so you can see that um, I've actually melted our palm oil. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to be, um, can you see? Our cassava is done so nyambi bi do jeh na, fim neka nak den kunyo tege. So I've just turned off the cassava. I'll be rinsing it with cold water so that it doesn't make it too wash mushy. And I'll show you how we make the sauce. So you can see that this is the one I first put the spring onion blended with the onions and the chili that's the one i first put okay this yen bi ma won nak bi nga sajje sa genna mom nga ñika jëf right so you can see we've actually caramelized this to this point <laughs> so what we're going to do is this yen do se neko bi fi we're just going to add this onion so ko defé nañu am di ñoo yi nga xamné dina nekka sauce This is just my way of cooking it, so it depends if you want to try it or stick to your own way of cooking it. Okay, this it. Yeah, so I've added a bit of palm oil. Alright, can you see? Yes, again, vitamin E lain kau defrek beli yang lebih halal dia nyudal di kau nyuluk tu tirek. So muna nyodal di kau sefal. I'm just gonna add my maggi to it now. Stock seasoning. So you can see that we've caramelized this. It's coming to an end now. Can you see how beautiful our sauce looks? Ah, so what if you're not doing am sa hetil linyong sula nehe sula so buko ta gis linyong nagmunga ko feel kasi why man nagnila di buka suma sauce niya be niya be niya be. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of water. Okay. Wow, that is when you look new for M. And this is where I taste to see if I need to add more salt or bring it to taste because you can't add um, black pepper. I do not add black pepper to mine. I just make sure it's well caramelized. And once you add this water, that's when all the flavors renders and make it into a very nice sauce. Magnifique. 
So after adding water, we just want to bring it to flavor. We just want to add a bit of flavor. I just add a little bit of prawns. I love this. It's a flavor enhancer. This is the prawn powder, smoked prawn powder, and just mix it inside. I'll just taste it to see. For the beans, you can see we're almost there. It's well cooked now, but we like it a bit mushy. Not all mushed up, but some of it mushed up. So I'll just leave it. Listen in. So just keep adding water. In case you don't want to overcook it, just add, keep adding the water once you see it until I show you the final consistency we want. That's when you stop with it. Right guys, so you can see our beans is almost there. And like I said, we like it somehow mushy. And also some of it, you can still see the beans. Ah, it gives me a little bit of a little so once you leave it to cool down it's gonna form a better consistency and oh la la look at our look at this it's beautiful well cooked as well right guys so you can see this is our oil all um soon do this is the oil to fry the fish so we're about to fry the fish I'm just gonna put the oil on and once it heats up, we'll add the fish to it. Such a sandba. Such a sandy mambala. So I've added bay leaves, quite a few bay leaves because I want my oil to taste very nice. And you know this habit of mine. So this is gonna be frying alongside our fish. I tell you, dalan not swim chat yun da wi nga ham nyom, ah? can see how beautiful our fish is frying. I'll just turn it on the other side. So this is our fried fish from the Smiling Coast. So let's just keep it. Okay. <laughs> so we turn it and fry it on the other side. So we're gonna leave it to fry nicely. So right, can you see our fish is almost done? It's done. This one is cooked well, fried as well. So I'll be just I'll just put some paper here. This is to ensure it just removes all the oil rendering from the fish. And we're back to this. Let's see. I think this one is done as well. So this one is done. Magnificent. Look at those garlic, garlic and bay leaf. Bay leafing the fish and garlicking the fish. <laughs> Beautiful. Right guys, everything is done, done, done. Our nyabe nyabe is finished, which is fried, fried fish, beans and sauce and cassava on the side is finished now which we call nyambe nyebe in the gambia you can see we represented mama africa all time all day every day <laughs> and i just i'm in love with my outfit come back <laughs> We fried it, it's so flavorsome and you'll be surprised to know that this is just the ingredients I showed you is what we what I use. So flavorsome and nice. What we're going to do is how we eat it, we normally add the, the cassava. I can just put it on the side here to display it. Add the cassava, take a bit of beans here, put the beans on top. Then you add the fish on the side fish on the side and our sauce on top of the beans absolute more formidable so I would just give you a better zoom of what I'm eating and we can eat it together like I told you this is a nice delicacy from the Gambia and I decided to share with this Ramadan 
vitamin nak mungkin kau try mui happy feeling nak wah nalen mana mana feel betul malah kau feel kau nak sahir feel bala also our fried fish is just lovely guys I recommend you to try hit the subscribe button like and share before you go anywhere let us give it a taste don't they ah dah ada lono nangka mana kau try mahu detail detail mahu aje masih kau aje masih so you call si si kamera bela lah pada saat depan kau ni so we take the fish, a bit of the cassava as well, then we add the sauce and the beans. Mm. This is absolutely beautiful. Look at the fish, make sure you fry it. You don't want it too soft and extremely hot. But you have to make sure it's well fried in order to give it a lovely consistency. Look at how gorgeous this is guys. Give it a try and tell me what you think.